This is Duke University. My name is Brianna Davis. I'm a rising junior at North Carolina Central University, and I chose to participate in the SROP program because I really wanted to gain my first basic science research experience. I really like the fact that this program offered students the ability to work closely with faculty and develop a mentoring relationship, as well as a community with other students who are interested in pursuing PhD or medical degrees. So the Duke SROP is a summer research opportunity program, and it's really exactly that. It happens in the summer. It's a opportunity for undergraduates from all over the country and actually beyond our country's borders to conduct research in really top caliber labs at a top tier institution. Well, if you look at the grad students in our department or all the biomedical sciences, you don't see too many minority students. And we thought that there was a way to fix that. And so we thought, well, this is a good way to give people a summer opportunity in research who might not have the same kind of opportunity at a high level place like Duke. People in the professorate, people doing science, should reflect the general population. And what I saw was not that at all. There were very few underrepresented students. And I realized that one of the main problems is that people need kind of a role model to enter a profession. And since there were very few role models, there was sort of nothing priming the pump. And so I felt, you know, sort of personally that we needed these programs to inc really encourage underrepresented students to think about going into science. And Ken and I really ran the program in, in the early days. And I, I should say, in fairness, Ken actually ran the program, but I was his assistant. And, and but so I was there from the beginning and we were really excited about it. I mean, I'm not sure if we had a web page yet in 96 or anything we might have. I remember we had like paper forms, the admissions office, was my dining room table. You can ask my wife, that's absolutely true. And we would have all the applications spread out and we would like, you know, start to sort them out and everything. So the program uh, is about, it runs about uh, 10 weeks. And the students who tend to come into the program are either freshmen, juniors, or sophomores. And what we do is get them linked up with a research lab where vigorous research is being undertaken. And the goal is to get them sufficiently interested in research to maybe consider taking up that as a career later on. I am mentored by one of the graduate students in the lab, and together we work to answer specific research questions relating to a specific project. I think I have, by participating in this program, a very good idea of what graduate school life is like. And it sounds absolutely amazing, and I'm really excited. This is a terrific opportunity for students who haven't had the opportunity to be in a really intensive research environment to get a taste of it and see if they liked it. See what if it was challenging, what if it they liked, whether this was going to be a place where they could thrive. And so I was very excited about it from the, from the beginning. That's why I've been an enthusiastic participant because I think this program has developed a lot of other programming which gives them a good introduction to the process of applying to and getting into and being a graduate student and I think that's a big part of the successful outcome of what this program accomplishes. I was very proactive being in this program so I was talking to professors, emailing a bunch of professors. So I actually talked to the actually the director of the MD PhD program here trying to see what I needed to do, how much research I needed and it was very helpful. I think the program allowed me to be able to get that experience. Through this program, I've been exposed to a lot of the aspects of research, and I realized that I really enjoy being able to ask questions that have not been asked before or may not already have the answer solved out. So that's been really enjoyable because I feel like I'm working on my own original project and I can contribute to existing knowledge in a way that hasn't been done before. Many of the students will say, I want to go to medical school, I want to be a doctor. And even for that, they need to acquire these experiences that go on their resume, that go on their application. But the hope is that for some of them, what was, oh yeah, I gotta do that, check. I gotta do, oh, I gotta shadow a physician, check. I gotta do some research, check. That check for research becomes more than a check, and it goes, oh my gosh, 
I didn't realize how important this is, how exciting this is. My name is Dr. Devin Gillette, and I'm currently the director of Duke's IMSD program called BioCore, and I actually was a participant in the SHROP program in 2009. So I think a lot of the tools and a lot of the lessons that I learned in the SROP program while at Duke really showed themselves into the work that I'm doing now. If it didn't have that foundation where I was able to go into the lab and be confident and feel like I'm a scientist and know what I was doing, and then now I can take all those tools and kind of push them and mold them into this program where I'm helping other students succeed in science, I think it's amazing. It's a, a great full circle to be able to have at once been you know, a student that was just, you know, getting my feet wet in the science field and learning, and now all of a sudden I'm directing a program at the same institution at Duke University where I have the opportunity to help others reach their potential and succeed in science. And it's all through the benefits of the SROP program for being able to instill in me that, you know, I can be a scientist and I can go to graduate school and I can be successful. To me, I think out of all the things I've done in, in science, uh, you know, I've, I've I've run a research lab, you know, for 30 years and, and published, you know, over 100 papers and, and, you know, I feel great about many of those. But, you know, in a way, I think the thing I'm most proud of is, is that we've given these students the opportunity. And when they, you know, years later talk about the fact that SRP had an influence on their career, it really makes me feel like, you know, all of the effort we put into it is, is more than paid off. 